on everybody it's titanic feet jack i'm back with you with another video before we get into it i need a couple things from you i need you to smash that like button on this video do leave a comment in the comment section let me know your thoughts on today's video and the sneaker we're about to look at and i do need y'all to hit that notification bell so you'll be notified every time i come back with a new video and if you want to mingle with me a little more other than here on youtube there's a link in the bio to my socials and you can also see me in the family vibes discord group today we take a look at a sneaker uh not a lot of hype behind it i like it quality material you know the saying rock what you like not what's hype let's get into it here's the box we have a jordan one box black background red writing gonna let you see that box tag i'm gonna read it out for you see it there jordan one retro high og color gorge green metallic silver side 14 price of these 180 us dollars uh on release day i did get a 15 dollars off discount at finish line so shout out to the guys at finish line as i show you that lot stamp right there uh do have some white tissue paper kind of smooth on one side a little rough on the other uh we have no green and white stickers in the box uh it's gonna be a pretty simple review because we seen a shoe very close to it's a very big box this is the box let's get into the shoe here we go guys we have the air jar retro one gorge green and on first sight I do love the materials on this sneaker and it kind of reminds me of Michigan State Spartan colors but let's get into it you have gorge green on your overlays your mud guard around your ankle collar and your heel it's made on an all-white base as you can see look how soft and ripped up this leather is it's pebbled up it's nice and soft you have a metallic silver swoosh and you do have the uh, bubble right here, pushed out bubble. And you have the Wings logo on there in black, silver. The guards green on the eyelets and all that good stuff. Come to the midsole, white midsole, guards green at the very bottom. Which leads to the outsole, all guards green outsole. Standard traditional jaw one outsole. Look at the back of the sneaker. You can see that good stitching going on there. This one comes on an authentic pair. You have the silver suit coming around from the other side. Gorge green, nice pebble leather. You have that white pebble leather going on up here around the ankle collar. Let's move on around to the medial side of the sneaker. More of that pebble tumbled leather on your white, I'm sorry, on your quarter panels, the white leather. You do have that silver, uh, Nike swoosh coming from the other side, gorge green again on your over there's around the ankle and going around the mud guards. Looking at the midsole white at the uh on your midsole, gorge green at the very bottom, which brings us around to the toe box. Y'all know how much I love that toe box. That was a good look, but let's get the uh tissue out of here. Comb stuff with tissue. There you go. Now we get a better look at that toe box. Okay, you can see, nice soft tumble. Look how it goes. I love the leather on the John one when it's like this or any shoe for that matter. And we do have a white nylon tongue. Comes factory lace just like this in the first eyelet with the gorge green laces. You do get additional laces. Here they go. There we go. We get white laces. This is how they come in the box. You see that Jordan Jumpman logo and it says shoe laces. And here we go on the other side. The Jordan Jumpman it says move to zero with the uh, recyclable sign. First seeing that sign on the this is trash line. And getting up the uh, tongue, you do have a gorge green woven patch with white Nike Air branding on here. Turn around to the other side, you do have some writing on here and the back of the tongue is white and a soft cotton material. 
material, you do have God's green sock liner going all the way around. And you look on the inside, it comes out. We do have a white shoe insert. You can see you have a Nike Air branding in the gorgeous green colorway. Your size 14 sticker. Flip it around. Here we go. Dream Cell technology on the back of the insole. And let's see, can we get a good look at that sizing tag? Well, try to get that up for you guys. There you go. And we're going to read it. It says US size 14 production date it is May 11th of this year to July 6th of this year. So just under two months of production with these. Not sure what the stock numbers were on these. I'll have to go back. Look on the stock numbers tab on my uh, Discord app in the Family Vibes Discord group to see what the stock numbers were. Because only not even two months of production, so I guess it wasn't gonna be a lot of hype for these, but I guess they based that off of past uh sales because the Bardo, there you go, same material and the Silver Tokyo Japan, there you go, same material. It just wasn't doing much on the resale market, and I guess Nike's paying attention to the resale market. But they felt the need to push this colorway out. Not sure if these were left over from the bar though, but they pushed these out. So let me know your thoughts on these. I like the material, I like the sneaker. I'm definitely gonna find a fit to bust these out. But this is the end of the video. And like I always tell you guys, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker. Because you never know, but it will be your turn to need help getting a sneaker. I'm Titanic Feet Jack, signing out.